Hey guys, uh, welcome back. This one's going to be a quick one. Um, I wanted to tie in some of the fundamental concepts that I use as well as far as life. Uh, first one, number one, probably most important is time. Uh, this is going to be the title of the video. It's going to be about how using time and thinking about time down to what it literally is can improve your productivity. So to all my subscribers, thank you guys for subscribing and welcome back again to this uh, new video. For those of you that are new, thank you for checking out my videos. Make sure you subscribe if you do like this content and uh, consider letting a friend know about the channel as well. Okay, so we're talking about time today, right? Time, four letter word, uh, it can mean a lot or it can mean a little. Uh, the way I think about time is it's actually something that we're only allowed a finite amount. Anything else in the world, if you think about it, you can make, you can make something. You can't make time. Um, you never know when you're gonna die, pass away, however you like to say it. You never know when that's gonna happen. Um, there are certain things that we can do to make, uh, make it easier for us to live. Obviously, you're not gonna walk out in traffic and expect to live. There are certain decisions, uh, using that as an example, certain decisions you can make to prevent your time from ending, all right? So now that we know time is very finite, uh, think about time in a sense of money. Uh, when you go do a job, you're trading your time for money. Uh, that's how that works, right? You can use that time to spend on yourself, uh, whether it be doing something you love, etc. But you do need money to survive. Now, the key thing is how do you, in turn, use as much time as you're allowed? Like, let's say you have 24 hours in the day. How do you use the maximum amount of those 24 hours to improve and change your mind? to use that time to focus on you, things that benefit you as a person, whether it be mentally, physically, emotionally, no matter what, it's you're using that time for yourself. Um, once you realize and can figure that little trick balance out, you're gonna be super productive and you're going to kind of maintain in a state of happiness um, because you're constantly improving yourself. And that's what we want to do constantly improve ourselves. So now with that said, it is going to require some sacrifice. Um, nothing is said to be had without sacrifice. Um, so for me, uh, using me as an example, I was in the Navy, um, as I've previously mentioned, I had to wake up, usually be at work at 6.30 sometimes. Um, that's usually about the earliest I have to be at work. So with that, time that I had to use to get ready, all that when I had to do it to go to work uh, in the Navy. So that was something that I already had to do for someone else to get essentially a paycheck. Um, now I still work. However, I have more flexibility. I can make that time up. So what I do is I now wake up early. I wake up at six in the morning. So in this case, you're going to have to sacrifice certain different aspects of what you're using your time for. Again, you're only given 24 hours in a day for our example, right? Um, you only have 24 hours in a day. What do you usually use? What do you usually do with those 24 hours? That's what it's going to come down to. Um, some people might sleep. Let's say they're sleeping 10 hours a day. Uh, how about you cut two hours here, two hours there, an hour here, and you use that time to make up in another uh, avenue. So for me personally, um, this can, you guys can start wherever you like. Um, I'm big into being physically fit and just, you know, just being able to perform. I don't know. I don't, I never know when the zombie apocalypse might happen, but I want to be able to pull my body weight and move and run and do all that without any, any issues. Um, so for me, I wake up at six in the morning, 
and then I have probably about an hour and a half of where I run and I do weights. Um, I'm like on a four day cycle, um, three days I work out, the fourth day is rest day and then I repeat that over and over again. Um, this is something I've been doing for several months, um, but it's one of those things that I mentioned, you start doing one thing and then eventually you'll learn to multitask and add more things to your schedule using the time that you actually already have. As I was saying, I wake up early. I have to give up a little bit of sleep on the evening. However, as I've gone through my journey and progressing and learning a lot about myself mentally, um, I've learned that social media for me was what I was wasting I won't say wasting, but I'll, yeah, let's be honest. I was wasting a lot of time on social media. So by cutting back on social media and paying my time to other people, not just other people, but like, how does social media benefit me if I'm not making thoughtful connections, if I'm just scrolling through, looking at pictures, all that? Yeah, some of it might be informational and it obviously depends on what you look at as well. So take that into account. Um, but if you're dumping a lot of time into that, it's not going to, you're not using that time on yourself. Um, whether it be reading books, let's say, uh, working out, relaxing, getting rest, um, uh, or working on a project that you find passionate, you know? So look at, just look back in different avenues. It's going to feel like a sacrifice at first, but once you actually make that sacrifice and you start actually seeing how it's benefiting you, it's gonna change the game. And that's, that's the thing, it takes time. It does take time, but stick through, value your time and trust me, it's going to feel great when you're just doing all these things autonomously. It's gonna be like, I wanna say, you're kind of like a robot, I sound like a robot, but it's gonna pay off in the long run. And that's what I see about time. So this is kind of it for this video. This is something that's totally new for the channel. I'm trying to add different components other than uh, just tech reviews. I know it's gonna be kind of broad. Um, some of you might just be here for tech reviews, but I thoughtfully ask you to consider some of the other things that I do have to offer or do have to talk about. Um, it could be helpful one day, you never know. But thank you guys for watching, staying through all the way to the end if you're still here. Uh, I do appreciate it. Let me know what you guys think about this topic, time. Uh, do you think the same way about time? Am I totally wrong? Am I an idiot? Uh, let me know in the comments below. I'm definitely interested in what you guys have to say. Um, so let me know. Uh, for my new subscribers, thank you guys again. Um, and I hope you let a friend know. Bye. Oh, wait, I totally forgot. So I did say I was going to keep trucking it along this this week uh, with videos. So tomorrow um, I do have an unboxing video. I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing the unboxing of, but you guys are getting another one tomorrow. So make sure you come, make sure you come back uh, to the channel.